Yo, what's up everyone? It's your boy. Today's video, I'm gonna be dueling against my boy Nim Nim. Let's go. It's gonna be a battle of the most Chad deck in the planet versus a bunch of little tiny ass insects, little baby insects, little ants, little ants in the mud that are gonna get stomped by my harmonizing magicians, okay? This is gonna be Pendulum versus Bee Trooper. Triff Gaming versus Nim Nim. Before we get to this video, I want you to do me a massive favor, but mainly yourselves a massive favor, and get the beautiful Pompey Playmat! This is the last day it's available! This is, in fact, there's a high chance I'm posting this and it's all sold out. My bad, if that's the case, go get another Playmat. But, you know, Black Friday, Cyber Monday, it's all done now. So rather than that, I didn't want the whole amazingness to go away of the awesome uh, month of November and of great sales. So I'm like, why not release an awesome play mat in the meantime for the boys? So with that being said, let's get straight into some absolute pendulum domination. Let us proceed. So we are going up against them, as I said, and this is our opening hand. We got double those lines. We got double our Celestia Joker. That's fine. He has some cards. I don't know what they do. They, they're just... Bro, they, they look ugly. Let me tell you that. Let me. I, this is my first time dueling against Beecher. Look at this. Fucking absolutely gross, bro. Like, imagine seeing one of these cards in real life. Like, imagine you just you see one of these centipedes. Like, you know, you're gonna step on it with your foot, right? Absolutely gross. But now, look at this. But now, what happens when you see Oaf Dre? Look at this absolute fucking Chad. Bench is at least three fifteen. Look at Joker. You already know this guy's the funniest guy in the friend group all the time, no matter what. Look at Double Iris. Definitely on. It lives in Paris. Uh, goes for uh, you know Fashion Week all the time. Tells you how to dress properly. Look at Celeste. Oh, in the suit. This is a suit. This is a bad suit. This is one of those like Gucci suits Celeste Magician's wearing. Harmonizing. You know, this is just the baby of the group, but has the best potential of the group. Maybe gonna grow up one day to be a doctor or something. And look at this. So this is just the boys. The boys. This is the. This is when you get your two OGs. This is Dragon Pit and Dragon Pulse. This is like the older brothers of the group, just chilling, telling everyone, you know, looking after everyone, making sure they're not sauced. That is, that is, bro, we can all be friends with these, but now look at these, bro. <laughs> I step on you, bro, what are you? Ar Arbalist Battle Walk, I, bro, get out of my face, bro. Anyways, we're gonna go pen call here, we're gonna get these, we're just gonna pen summon. He only has so many negates, look at this ugly card, what's he gonna do, negate? It's a trap card, I don't even wanna look at your name. So he's gonna attempt to negate that, and that's fine. We purposely, no, we do not normal summon the Joker because we're a massive big brain play. We don't normal summon the Joker. Actually, what we do is we normal summon the harmonizing and we do this on purpose. So you go uh, Needle Fiber here. Uh, so he's gonna do some stuff there. I'm not really sure what that is. He's gonna do that. I'm gonna attack with that. Then at this point, I'm gonna link these into Verte at the very end, boom, and get myself a free DPE. This is my DPE variant. Uh, we do have Scythe somewhere in this deck, but we couldn't bring out the Scythe. Maybe we could. Nah, we couldn't bring it and still play around all those interruptions. We don't care about Atlas because Pen Call is, uh, pen call is live right now, which means our Pen Graph is going to be able to send. So we're going to send this uh, with Pen Graph, and then Deep E is going to deal with whatever cards he has. And on our turn, he's gonna, we're going to draw two and get a free special summon with Dasher. So he's clapped. There's nothing he can do. We're going to let him kill with Deep E. We're going to use Deep E effect to summon it back. I'm like, that's all right. That's okay. I could have pen, call, pen graphed that. I do it right there after he summons. I'm like, it'll pop that, send that. And there's not much you can do at this point. This is main phase two. You know, my scales are protected. If he outs my vertex, I don't care. If he outs my trap, I don't care. He's trying to set up a follow-up for himself. He gets up another atlas. I'm like, that's A-OK, -okay, my friend. There's just not much you can do. You know, Bee Troopers do cool things. Like, if you can see, this is like a lot of summons they're doing. It's a lot of cool things. It actually is. But until they release, like, at least a spell trap negate, at least they release, until they release something else, like, you can't just rely on a few monster effects. It's not going to be enough against good decks like Pendulum. Here we use Dasher's effect, and Pendulum is absolutely broken. Just summon the Celestial here. Uh, he banished our DPE or put it back in deck, but we're, we don't care. We're gonna, so it still triggers to summon Celestial. So he's going to summon out some cards. It's going to be his, uh, ver his form of a negate. I'm like, sure thing, dude. Oaf Dragon, we're going to normal now. We're going to get Time Star here. He's going to negate the effect of that. I'm going to trigger Pengraph to set, make sure that gets sent before. Uh, uh, too easy. It's too easy. He recognizes defeat there. So now we're going to go into game number two. I don't like bugs, dude. <laughs> Just to fuck around with Nim Nim. I'm on Nim Nim. I'm entertaining Nim Nim's chat while he went to go to the washroom and get some food or something. So I'm like, hey, guys, you guys want to screw around with Nim Nim inside irritating Arasol just for the lulls? 
Oh, worse for Geki. Destroy all insect monsters in the field. <laughs> Dark hole, but for insects only. <laughs> we thought it would be so hilarious just to screw with him. Would I ever play this card? No. It's awful. Don't play this card. But we thought just for jokes, let's do it. Especially in his, it does nothing against his deck. We also played uh, Verdant Sanctuary. Like, just some funny cards. Uh, just for fun. You know, this is a fun duel. Uh, just, to, <laughs> just to see his response. Because he thinks this is my actual side deck. But... Just to see his response, so we just have a little fun with him here. Uh, if you know what, if it was my choice, I would rather just be like literally Metal Fools Volflame with no Metal Fools spells and traps on the deck, just any pendulum monster or scale. It'll be so much more helpful here because you're gonna see his end board does nothing, but it's okay. You know, you, when you play with your friends, you play for banter, like you play for fun. You know, it, it's nothing real. I pretend that I have an Ibiru just to, to screw around with him. But, like, you know, when you play your friend, it's not it's not a YCS here, you know? You're, like, you're just playing for fun, like, especially at Locals. You can see me at Locals. Like, we have, have the most fun ever with my friends at Locals. We won't take the game too seriously. We just have a good time. Of course, when you get to, like, actual Locals and regionals, I mean, regionals, YCSs, take it seriously. <laughs> I'm like, ah, you're kidding, get the heck out of here. But, like, it doesn't get rid of any interruption. It does nothing. So these go, but, like, this does, does nothing to the main card. And, like, obviously, we would have rather than anything else. And here, we're going to do a big brain play. We're going to double eye. We're going to no waste our normal summon Harmo to double Iris to be able to search our star pen graph. Uh, instantly, I'm like, oh, maybe I should have, uh, you know, Cosmic, we couldn't really uh, foretell that. We go star pendulum. We do a cool play here where we uh, link one to be able to search uh, the wisdom eye. The wisdom eye is just going to ensure we get an Oath Dragon. Oath Dragon is just going to add back to Harmo. We're going to put summon one underneath here in the Harmo. We still end up with a huge amount of monsters. It's going to negate our Harmo. And I just saw Insect Barrier as for lulls. This is like the worst card in history. Insect Monster you put in control cannot declare an attack. <laughs> it's so bad. It's like, like, it's so awful. But it's just fun anyways. Just uh, troll him. So here we go. Time Star. Time Star is going to be able to get us a low scale. Uh, sorry, not low scale. A tuner. That's going to get us access to Needle Fiber. That's going to get us access to Selene. Uh, he's at 6400, uh, so this gets us access code. We can't pop his card here. I'm gonna pop that, uh, his spell and attack. Puts him at 1100, gets us a Zeus. Now we just have to make sure this will be enough to stop him. I honestly don't think it'll be enough to stop him, but we're gonna do our best. Uh, I'm pretty sure I should have Zeus there, but I keep in mind that if I Zeus, it has to be the very last play because I have to get rid of my whole field. I'll have no follow up whatsoever. He draws a anti spell. Uh, and then, uh, so he gets uh, the monster. I gotta be careful because he also has follow up in his grave. In fact, I don't want to use my Zeus. I actually let him kill my Zeus. I don't even use it just in case. Because look at my setup here. He has to. For he how is he adding an access code? And even if he does, which he just did there, we're alive. And we have scales. Next turn, we win now easily. Easily. Absolutely easily. So he summons this out as well, does some extra damage. I'm like, all right, no problem. So here we're gonna draw. I'm like, this duel is over now. This duel is over. Uh, so here, I'm gonna go Prosp. He's only, I only have to do 2200 damage. I see Joker, I'm just like, oh, GG. It's, it's over. He does have one interruption here, so he negates that. I just use Ult add Harmo, Pendulum, everything. And I'm gonna go Barone to Floor, and then this is gonna be obvious game. Barone to Floor, just pop this, make anything. Attack, attack. GG's Nim Nim. That was a hilarious match. Great match. Show, he was showcasing that B Troopers actually can do cool things. Just unfortunately, they don't have all their support yet and eventually when b troopers do get a form of spell trap negation maybe a better extra deck card to, to combine with their main link four to combine with the atlas maybe like a synchro uh maybe a, a xyz or synchro that just like negates spell or trap i think that could be very good uh i think the deck could be solid but until then uh it's gonna get stomped uh stomped on the boot by uh joker's boot and by look at that boot that's insane or by, by performing a pendulum sorcerer's feet, which you can get on tripgaming.com. Right there. See his foot? Right there. It's cool. If you want to be cool, then get one of these now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Massive shout out to Nim Nim for a bla uh, blast dueling as always. Make sure to go subscribe to not just my channel, but also Nim Nim's channel. Both links will be down in the description below. And if you guys like the video, make sure to like the button, uh, smash the like button as well. And we'll see you guys at the next video.